My name's Kaya Huff, I go to Winston High, and I'm a senior guard. Donna Rogers, Indian Land High School, sophomore point guard. Kaya, um, all area player of the year. We got 13 schools in our area uh, that the Herald covers. You know, how does it feel to be named the uh, the player of the year for, for girls basketball? Um, it was an honor for me to be pl named player of the year. I mean, I'm, knowing that I was out my whole junior year, I didn't think I could come back and get player of the year. So it was an honor to get that. Yeah, Darnell, I mean, same question. You know, a lot of schools, a lot of good boys basketball players around here. You know, how, how's it feel to, to be the, the player of the year? I mean, it's a great feeling knowing that I worked so hard this year for me and my team to do what we did. So it's just a great feeling getting all the wins that we did, the same as last year. Um, who's a uh, who's an NBA guy you're, you're you're looking up to right now that you that you really like? Chris Paul. Chris Paul. How come? Because he's a general. Like he runs his team very well. Yeah. Somebody you style yourself after? Yeah. Yeah. Kaya, how about you? You got a NBA or even WNBA player that you're that you're fond of? Uh, yeah. NBA, my favorite player is Kobe. I mean, I love his style of play. And WNBA, I like Lindsey Whalen. She's a point guard. She tells her team what to do. She won like how many? She won a couple championships back to back. So I look up to her. Yeah, you think? Uh, who do you think it would win, Lindsey Whalen or uh, Chris Paul in a one-on-one? -on -one? Chris Paul, of course. <laughs> I don't know. It'd be close. I, I go for Lindsey Whalen though. Yeah. Yeah. Free takebacks. <laughs> Make a ticket. Um, Kaya, you're going to uh, Western Carolina next year to play college basketball. What would you, what would be your advice to somebody like Darnell, who's a sophomore, you know, who's kind of probably going to try to follow, you know, in your kind of footsteps? I mean, he's already on the right path. He works hard. I'm sure he works out every day to improve on his game. So just keep it up. I mean, do good in the classroom because that's where it basically comes from. So just keep up the hard work and you'll get there. Yeah, Darnell, anything that uh, Kaya could take from your game, maybe? Just play hard every time you hit the floor. Give it your all. That was that was PC. <laughs> you guys were uh, a game away from the state championship, so I know I know this award is nice. Um, you know, would, how quickly would you have traded it for a for a state championship appearance? Very quickly. <laughs> Very quickly. <laughs> right. I think this is uh, pretty cool because, like you said, you were out last year. You know, tell pe tell people what it um, what it was like to go through rehab, and you know, how long did it take, and and what was the kind of stuff you had to do. All right, so I tore my ACL last summer in practice, AU practice. So it was kind of hard knowing that I tore my ACL in practice instead of a game. Right. So, I mean, coming back was, it was hard for me. It's not an easy thing to do. But, I mean, my dad pushed me all the time. We went to the gym almost every morning. I worked out all the time. So, I mean, you just got to put in the work to come back from the injury. Right, right. Did you have a moment when uh, this season you realized, like, yeah, like, I'm back? First game, I mean, like, before we started, I was like, it was our first home game, so I was a little nervous because they haven't seen me in, since my sophomore year. So I was coming back. I was like, yeah, this is my time to come, to come and play hard. So it was my first game when I thought I was there. Yeah. Greater, I mean, you were kind of like the unquestioned leader of your team. You know, what's that What's that like to have guys that are, you know, a couple years older than you and, and having kids kind of like looking up to you and deferring to you on the court? I mean, I've been doing it since middle school, so it wasn't a surprise. I knew I could run my team. Yeah, um, is that something you that they accepted readily, or did you kind of yeah, have to accepted. create they that? They had to accept it. I've been <laughs> on the team way longer than everybody on the team. That's true. You played since seventh grade. Yes, sir. Right, right. Uh, well, so this is your so this was your fourth year then. This was like your senior year, kind of. Yeah. Right, right. Um, you know what what uh, what kind of taste did that leave in your mouth though, losing that game to Newberry? You know, headed into the off season. I mean, it was a bad feeling, emotional. I wanted to get a ring so badly. I wanted to get one for my coach and my senior, Lee McCall. Right, right. And uh, you told me that you were you grew up in France, so can you leave us with a, a little message in French? Right, you want me to say something in French? Yes. Uh, bonjour tout le monde en France. All right, which means? Uh, hello, everybody in France. <laughs>